Hey, Troy, how you doing? This is Manny with uh, Manny's SEO and Web Design. We spoke on the phone. So here's a video explaining what happened. So when I, the way I found you was I looked up electricians in Union, New Jersey. And, and then I went straight. You got Yelp. I looked in Yelp, Home Advisor, and I believe I found you on Angie's List. Now, I know you said you just signed up because it's free. But you said you tried uh, Home Defense. Uh, Yelp, I mean Home Advisor, Yelp, and um, Yellow Pages, whatever. You dump money in all these services to try to get leads, and none of them worked. But this is why. They're all the same like Angie's List. You see, when you put up when you put up a list, you get a bunch of different contracts. See, all these companies. As you keep scrolling down, they're all right here. See? So you fall in this category somewhere, in this pile. Somewhere here I found you. I don't even know which one now, but you see Lodi, there's a whole bunch of companies. You could be any one of these. But how am I supposed to know which which one? Look, you got plumbing and heating, uh, elect electrical contractor. Um, I was looking for an electrician. I ended up finding you, which is a general contractor. So look, a full house inspection company. I mean, they're all right here under the same category I mean I'm looking for an electrician I'm getting a bunch of different things what I'm talking about is something totally different so what I'm talking about is going here or picking up your smartphone or going on a computer and I need a general contractor and so and I live in Elizabeth so I'm gonna hit general contractor in Elizabeth which is where you're at the beginning sometimes you have a bunch of ads before this map but people usually skip over the ads go to this map and right here they stop right here in these three most people don't even scroll down they don't even get because you know when you get to here you got home advisory Angie's list um, and then you know eventually you, the companies will start popping up again but most people they if I'm looking and I'm desperate I need a general contract and I need them today I'm just gonna look up general contract in Elizabeth I'm going to scroll past the ads and I'm going to go right to this map pack because these are the, are the most loyal. And the way it works is the way to get into these three, these map packs is through a good website. This one is an ad, so he's paying for it. So his website might not even be that good. So to me, the number one contractor is this one. And let's, and then when you click on it, which I already did, it's right here. This is his website. Now, he's got picture, he's got content. To make a good website, there's three keys that Google likes. First of all, Google loves content because they love to read. Your homepage should have at least 15, uh, 1,500 to 2,000 words of content, but not just any content. Talking about the business, the product, using keywords that are gonna rank you locally to help you found. Then you got your about us and your service page. Each one of these service pages, so you should have a service page for every everything that you do. They should contain about five, uh, 500 to 700 uh, content targeting keywords that have to do with like this one, commercial roofing, anything to do with roofing and all that. You should have at least 700 words of content there. That's key. And then, um, so if you take this website, and you dump it in my tool here that I have a refs which I already did and let's go back All right, let's go back to the beginning so anyway while we wait let me get the name again to make sure so while it's coming back wait here it is So we dump the name in here. All right, let's see what his website looks like. Anyway, so content. The next one would be backlinks and citations. Now, citations is anywhere, any website that you can go to anywhere, like a Yelp or a Lineable or anywhere where you can go and leave the information of your, your company name, phone number, email address, and all all your information that will lead back to your company that's a citation this is something you could do on your own but it's uh, time consuming um, you have to actually go into the website 
pull your information, put an email, then they're going to send you an email, you wait for that email, and then you verify, you log on to that email and verify that it's you, and then you put in all your information for your company, and that leads back to your company, that's a citation. As you can see, this one has um, citation, this one has 16 URLs, which is like citation, this would be your trust flow, which he has no trust flow. He has 34 black backlinks, but with zero trust flow, it means that they're not very good backlinks. But he's being found for 103 keywords. So when we look at it, getting back to the content like we were talking about, you look at the keywords, these are all the keywords that he's being found. Now, most of it is his name, U.S. General Contractor. But because he has a general name, like General Contractor, we can actually use that for ourselves and put, and put them in, like saying the name of your company and here we are general contractors that come to your need. Or, so we could actually take that keyword and use it for ourselves. We got the, uh, look, masonry restoration contractor. So we could talk about masonry, big keyword there. Right now he's in the eighth spot, so he's not being found for that. Over here, basically his name, he's number one position because of his name, which is something that we can use because the general contractor is doesn't, it doesn't have to be the name of a company. Uh, the next thing is the citations and backlinks. Now, backlinks are when you go into a website or anywhere you go and you create like a blog or you write the review. So you have to go into a website, you read their article, and then you uh, you want to leave like a review or a blog talking about that article and where somewhere where you can put your your URL which is the address of your website and it links back now he has 34 backlinks what I like to do is look to look at the competition and click on the backlinks to see what how, what backlinks are they using so you see general contracted so mostly most of his backlinks are coming from his own website but here's one best 30 home builders in elizabeth so that's in the yellow page so we go in there we put all our information leave a little website boom so i like to call this the copycat method where we take all his backlinks that are you know, only the good ones, not the spammy ones, but just the good ones so that we can get quality uh, customers. You want the good quality customers. Like you said that you were dumping money and out of 10, 10 customer potential uh, clients, only two of them were like really good customers or one of them was a good customer. The rest were spammy. Uh... So what we do is we take the good backlinks and add on to our website and then create more so that we can knock them out of the park and put us in the number one spot. So, and again, these are and citations, same thing. What I, like to, what I like to do right off the bat is dump in 100 citations right when the website's done. We dump in about 100 citations and that'll blow these right out of the park. And the majority, most of the time you'll see like 20 citations and like 20 backlinks, whatever. You put 100 in there right off the bat and we're going to blow them. Your name is going to be right there, right off the bat. And you're the first person that they're going to be found. Um, like I said, you can do all this yourself. It's just very time consuming. So like once you build a website and then you do the citations and the backlinks, you know, it's uh, you got it's just time consuming. You got to go into every every uh, website. You got to go into uh, anywhere where you can do a citation. And like I said, you write the name, you, you know, you got to put your email address and your password and then they're going to send you a uh, an email confirming that you are who you are and then all you do is log on from your email and you put all your company's information and you fill out all that information that's a citation and the backlinks you got to write a blog you write a little story about whatever the topic is you got to read the article talk about the article and then put the blog and then you leave your uh, website um, or ERL which is which is uh, getting to the we're getting to a website. Let's go to a website. This. Where's the website? I don't have a website. Oh, that would be this. This is your URL. So you leave this somewhere in that in the blog. And this way, when they click on it, it'll come back to your web page. That's a black backlink. And that'll get you uh, that'll get you more traffic. And then Google will think that you're uh, popular 
And it, this is more like a popular contest. So you want to win the popularity contest. You win the popularity contest, you're going to get those phone calls and you're going to get a lot of business. And then that, that pays for the website and everything by itself. So if it's something you're interested in, if you have any more questions about that, my number is 908-391-7666. You can give me a call anytime. I'll answer any questions. Uh, if you'd like to go forward, we li I'd like to set up a meeting. We can talk and maybe discuss the possibility of creating your own website. I really believe that every business should have a website. But if you're going to spend the money on a website, you can throw all the money you have on a website. If you don't do the SEO part, which is the SEO is what gets you in here. If you don't spend the SEO, you might as well just throw your money away because that website is is useless without SEO. You want to be you want people to find you, not a website that you can direct people to go to because then only the people you know are going to find your website. No, you want a website that's that's going to attract that people you don't know. That's the ones you want, the people that you don't know and they come to you. So again, let, let me know if you like this video. I just like your feedback. And if you're interested in going further or at least having a talking about it, talking doesn't hurt anything. Talk is free. I'm here for uh, any questions you have. And you have a good weekend.